Hello everybody, this is Justin Armstrong. I'm back with another video. This will be my um, July 27th DVD slash Blu-ray review. Um, I actually stopped by my local Dollar Tree. I stopped by two Dollar Trees um, today to pick up some movies since they had them for a dollar. You couldn't beat it. They didn't have so they didn't have uh, many titles to choose from. So I, you know, I grabbed um, I grabbed a few that I saw that looked interesting. So I'm gonna show them. Plus, I went to Walmart and, and got um, two DVDs. So I'm gonna kick it off with uh, one of the, I, I got was none other. I'm a huge fan of the King of Rock and Roll, Elvis Presley. Um, so I decided to pick up Elvis Presley Clam Bake. Is um, this movie was made in 1967? Um, they finally released the movie on Blu-ray. They released it last year. Last year, and I didn't even know that they um, released it until. About maybe a week ago. So I decided to pick it up. I said, hey, you know, I've always wanted to watch Clam Bake in, on Blu-ray. Who wouldn't want to watch Elvis on Blu-ray? So I, um, Elvis co-stars with um, Shelley Fabre in this um, hit movie. Um, Clam Bake with Elvis. I love the artwork that they have. But the only thing, and then there's the back. The only thing I don't like about it is... The inside. Look at the inside. It just has the name and the studio. It does not, you know, and there's like a booklet of other movies that they had and stuff. But, you know, I would thought that since it's a big Elvis movie, I know Clam Bake really wasn't a big Elvis movie, but, you know, still, I wish they could have included some type of artwork in it. All right, this is a movie I... A DVD, might as well say, because this is from a TV show that I picked up at Dollar Tree for only a dollar. I said, heck, you know, I was a fan of the TV show, so um, I was like, heck, might as well go ahead and get it. And I love the songs in it, so Glee Encore. Um, it includes over 30 great musical performances back to back. Um, you know, you're not going to get the latest of Glee. You're going to get the 2009-2010 version of Glee because this was when the DVD was released. I, I guess they didn't sell a lot of DVDs of this so they decided to put it Dollar Tree for a dollar. So I picked it up and I'm, I'm a huge fan of uh, Glee. Alright, this came out this past Tuesday and if you're a big WWE fan, this one is for you. To me, this um, has been one of the best Money in the Bank pay-per-views I've ever seen. Um... So here it is. Money in the Bank 2018. The night that Braun Strowman took over and won the Money in the Bank um, ladder match. Alexa Bliss won her Money in the Bank. Um, you, got, you got to see a classic bout between Ronda Rousey and Nia Jax. You know, it has some great moments, um, especially with um, Shinsuke Nakamura and AJ Styles in the last man standing match. With, and also Roman Reigns versus Jinder Mahal. Okay, I picked this up today from Big Lots. Um, it's a three-disc combo pack, and it's an exclusive. Roughly, these type of DVDs run maybe $10, $15, $15, $20 right here. But um, I picked it up. It was only for $5, so I just said, hey, with it, might as well get it. It was Brad Pitt Moneyball. If you guys haven't seen this, this is a good movie. I remember watching it in um, math class and I think social studies as well. And it has a lot to do with baseball. So if you, if you guys are a baseball fan and have never seen Moneyball, go check it out. I just picked it up because it was an exclusive three-disc combo pack. It has the Blu-ray, the DVD, plus a bonus DVD of Studio 42 with Bob Costas. It's seen on MLB Network. It's a 45-minute um, interview. Plus, it includes that with Brad Pitt and a lot of the um, cast. All right, and I, and I was actually shocked when I saw this on... Uh, when I actually see this in the pile of movies at um, Dollar Tree today. Um, I was like, why is this in here? 
But overall, it's the Marine for the moving target with um, the Miz and Summer Rae. So if you guys haven't checked this out, go check it out. I seen the um, it was Marine Two and the first Marine at Big Lots. I'm gonna pick that up next week and I'm gonna do a review. So I think I've already got the Marine Three. I'm gonna make sure, but that was the Marine Four. I'm a huge WWE fan, but I don't think this movie did too good. So I think that's what the reason why it was in uh in the pile. Okay, guys. I've actually never seen this movie. This movie was made back in the, what, the 90s, I want to say. I can't, I can't find what year it, was, it came out. But, this movie, it might have been the 80s. Yeah, it might have been the 80s. I can't find it nowhere, guys. But, it was made by um, New Line Home Entertainment. It is with Whoopi Goldberg. I've actually never seen this movie before, so it's going to be a great adventure seeing it. I've heard a lot of bad reviews on this film, but I said, hey, with it for a dollar, you can't beat it. So here's Whoopi Goldberg, the Theodore Rex. So if you guys have seen this movie, comment below what, um, if you guys have seen this. I sure would love to hear your reviews on the movie. But hey, for a dollar, you can't beat it. Um, then I saw... I love, I love the artwork on this. That's the reason why I got it. Because I love the artwork. But this is a 1950s show. It's called The Adventures of Francis. The Talking Mural. Volume 1. So I had to pick I had to pick it up at Dollar Tree. Since it was a dollar. Because I love the artwork with the mule. And then it's, you know, it's got the um, it's got the fence right here. So I said hey. Might as well pick it up. Alright. If you guys... Don't like Harry Styles or One Direction. I don't know what you guys are missing, but heck, I had to pick this up for a dollar today. It's One Direction, where we are live from San Sirio Stadium. And it looks like it's from Britain or Australia. It looks like an Australian thing, but it's made, it's made for the United States, though. But, you know, it features over 20 songs in this concert. So, I said, hey, with might as well, for a dollar, pick it up. I think, alright, this movie, I think it won a Oscar, I think. I think this movie might be a, a movie from India, but I don't think so. Um, and I bought this also for a dollar. It's um, Charlie Countryman. And I can't. I don't know the first name, but there it is, guys. Charlie Countryman. It looks like a good um, good movie. Can't wait to watch it. I've never seen this movie of Jane Fonda or Katherine Kenner. But I said, hey, with $4, uh, made by the independent film. Independent film. So, I can't wait. Might as well get it. It's um, Peace, Love, and Misunderstanding. I also got that for a dollar at my um, second trip of the Dollar Tree. Can't wait to watch that. Um, with This is with Twilight's Robert Pattinson. Um, you know, this, this movie features a lot of the great, you know, a lot of great actors and actresses in here. Is um, Cosmopolis. I got this for a dollar as well at Dollar Tree. I love the artwork. The artwork, you know, is shiny and everything. So, that's the, reason, that's the reason why it stood out to me. But I cannot wait to watch it. It's Cosmopolis. Okay, if you guys um, have seen any of those movies that I just picked up, comment below what you guys think of the movies. I sure would appreciate it. Um, don't forget to like this video, comment below what you guys thought, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next week. Love you guys. Thank you.